ini boleh ya tu Abdul Khan Sob ke Anil TV Good Morning Show dah swadat kau aje. Tu ahiwi first Bible verse saya lawa. The Lord bless you and watch, guard and keep you. Numbers 6:24. Jesus, looking at them, said, "With men it is impossible, but not with God, for all things are possible with God." Mark 10:27. For we walk by faith and not by sight. Second Corinthians 5:7. The only way to do great work is to love what you do. Success is not final. Failure is not fatal. It is the courage to continue that counts. Believe you can in your halfway dear. Today's science segment silo. Lung cancer is a cancer that begins in the lungs and most often occurs in people who smoke. Two major types of lung cancer are non-small cell lung cancer and small cell lung cancer non small cell lung cancer it is a type of lung cancer that can affect smoker as well as non smokers small cell lung cancer it is a fast growing type of lung cancer commonly caused by smoking symptoms of lung cancer a cough that does not go away or get worse hoarseness loss of appetite shortness of breath weight loss coughing up blood or rust colored sputum feeling tired or weak new onset if wheezing precautions of lung cancer do not smoke avoid second hand smoke limit intake of alcohol exercise regularly eat a diet full of fruits and vegetables lower exposure to radon gas Tuideru news headlines kan silo. Today national conference on cyber crime underway. The today national conference on cyber crime, digital forensic and intelligence 2024 consumed today at Capital Convention Center in Kuima, organized by the National Institute of Electronics and Information Technology Kuima, in collaboration with. Nagaland Police, the Government of Nagaland, and the Department of Information Technology and Communication, with support from the United Service Institution of India. The event brings together key stakeholders to address pressuring issues in cybersecurity. Integrating the conference, special guests and advisor for IT and C, economics, statistics, and evolution, Setong Q Sangtam. Praised the efforts of NIELTI, the Ministry of Electronics and Information Technology, Government of Nagaland's IT and Communication Department, and the Nagaland Police for organizing this crucial event. To the National Conference on Cyber Crime, do Kuima Capital Convention Center de Jaise Aro. It is an integration program day. Advisor for IT and C, Economics, Statistics and Evolution, Setron Q Sangtambra. It is NIEL IT Kanwa. It is a national conference organized by Kani. Tahanna efforts can press Kuisha. Horti Department begs another national award. State Horticulture Department receive yet another prestigious national award for promotion of best horticulture farming and products at the recently concluded International Agriculture and Horti Expo held at Pragati Maidan, New Delhi. A yearly event organized by NNS Media Group, the event was held from July 20 to 22, showcasing the base in agricultural and horticultural advancement from across the country. The department was represented by three officials and a representative from Entrepreneurs Associate, highlighting the collaborative spirit and commitment toward the horticultural excellence. NSS Media Group Kanwa, July 22nd, New Delhi, Brakati, Maidande, International Agriculture and Horti Expo Organized Kushia Aridu Expo De, Nagalenbi, Ekta, National Award Paishe, Promotion of Base Agriculture, Promotion of Base Horticulture Farming and Products Day Idu, Prestigious National Award Paishe. Boys Hostels in Three Polytechnics Integrated, Advisor to CM for Transport and Technical Education Department, Tum Jem Memba, 
virtually integrated three bisostal in government polytechnic Kwema, Heloshe Polytechnic Atoizu, and Government Polytechnic Zanazo Chetiba Pek on July 25th from the Directorate of Technical Education Kwema in the presence of the Director, Technical Education Officers, Principals and Faculty of the Department. Advisor Tumjaman Bara. July 2050, Tinta Polytechnics Boys Hostel in your Great Kruse, Ektadu, Government Polytechnic Khoima, Helosha Polytechnic Atoizu, Aro, Government Polytechnic Tsunazo, Chetiba Pekte, Idu Boys Hostel in your Great Kruse. Center sessions, rupees 21.56 score for tribal cultural experience at Jumugidima. The center has sanctioned rupees 21.56 score for the project. Tribal Cultural Experience at Midway Retreat, Jumugidima, under the scheme of Swadesh Darshan 2.0 for Development of Domestic Tourism. This information was given by the Union Minister for Tourism and Culture, Gajendra Singh Shekhawat, in a written reply in Rajya Sabha today. The Minister informed that for development of new destinations, the Ministry of Tourism has revamped the Swadesh Darshan scheme as Swadesh Darshan 2.0 with the objective to develop sustainable and responsible tourism destinations following a destination and tourism center approach. Jumugidi Mare Tribal Cultural Experience Nimiti Karni Center Kanwa Rupees 21.56 score Sension Kuruna Ase Union Minister for Tourism and Culture Gajendra Singh Shekhawadwa Raja Sabage, you do announce Kurushe. Former GOC Nagaland Lieutenant General Lakira to be new DG Assam Rifles. Assam Rifles in Northeast will get its new administrative post. Lieutenant General Vikas Lakira, former GOC Nagaland and ex IG Assam Rifles, will now be new Director General Assam Rifle. He will be posted in Shillong. Recently, he was promoted from Major General rank to Lieutenant General and was posted to Army Headquarters for some time. Lieutenant General Lakira takes over his new assignment and replaces outgoing DGAR Lieutenant General P.C. Nier, who is retiring on July 31st. Lieutenant General Vikas Lakira Ra Itedu, Director General Assam Rifle Hwale Sekuna Janaisha Aro, Lieutenant General Du, former GOC Nagalen, Aro ex IG Assam Rifle Takishin. Aro DGAR, Lieutenant General PC Niardu, July 31st, retired Hwale Sekuna Janaisha. DH and FW informs about FSSAI license registration for PDW. The Department of Health and Family Welfare has informed that many packaged drinking water PDW, manufacturers, suppliers are functioning without BIS license, which is preconditioned to apply for FSSAI license registration. Consumption of clean and safe drinking water is a human fundamental right, which is crucial in maintaining good health and it is the responsibility of PDW, manufacturer, supplier, to provide clean, hygienic and safe water to its customers, the department said. The department stated that the regulation 2.3.14, clause 17 and clause 18 of the Food Safety and Standard Provision and Restriction on Sales, Regulation 2011, states that no person shall manufacture, sell or exhibit for sale, packaged drinking water and mineral water except under the Bureau of Indian Standards Certification Mark. Accordingly, all the PDW suppliers have been informed that BIS license is mandatory irrespective of the annual turnover. Further, any import of PDW mineral water from outside the state without BIS certification is not allowed for sale within the state. Department of Health and Family Welfare Janai Dishegi, Kun manufacturers or suppliers cannot package drinking water or mineral water, de, BIS certification na takina, state bitter de biga ise, it can't do allowed nai, aru, idu do, consumers, customers, kun idu pani drink rese, tahan limite karni, clean aru, hygienic no hoina, biga ise koina, janai dishe. Our manufacturers, our suppliers, can so be BIS licensed, takina, bika vi koina, itlo porivi, janai dishe. 
Nagaland online tape reporting system logs for the two cases in three days. Three days after it launched, the online complaint submission system for stolen vehicles and lost or stolen mobile phones, the Nagaland police has received information on a total 42 incidents. In a post on X, the state police force noted the encouraging response to the initiative which was announced on July 22nd. We have so far received information on 36 lost stolen mobiles and 8 stolen vehicles, it stated. Further, it also warned and advised the general public not to buy second-hand mobiles or vehicles to avoid legal troubles and risk of losing the stolen goods if caught by the police. Nagaland Police Kanwa Online Complaint Submission System Launch Kura Tindin Pa Bitore Nagaland Idu Chorkura Vehicles Aru Idu Mobile Control Kura Dela Case Information Received Kurushe Koina Nagaland Police Kanwa Janai Dishe Aru Idu 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 Encouraging Response Ase Public Aru Citizens Khan Side Wa Ase Koina Takanwa Expte Post Kurushe Aru Idu 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 Atta vehicles chor kui jala information pai she kui na janai di she. Aru itula opore general public kange janai di she ki second hand mobiles aru vehicles kan ne kini vi legal troubles kan noi livi itu hari jala aru risk nolo vi kui na nagaland police kanwa citizens kan aru general public kange janai di she. Three JE patients from Dimapur undergoing treatment in Guwahati. Three patients from Dimapur who were diagnosed. With Japanese encephalitis in Guadi last month, remain hospitalized there as they continue to receive treatment for the disease. An official from the Nagaland Health and Welfare Department said that the State Department was notified of the three cases by Guadi Health authorities two weeks ago. Following the notification, the department initiated surveillance measures in the patients' residential areas in Dimapur. To date, no J cases have been detected in Dimapur or other parts of the state, the official said. Another source from Health Department also confirmed that Dimapur has not witnessed any confirmed dengue case so far this year. It may be mentioned that in 2023, a total of 4,318 dengue cases were recorded across the state with 2,034 confirmed cases in Dimapur alone which led the Health and Family Welfare Department to declare dengue as an epidemic on September 19, 2023. The same year, 19 J cases were reported in the state including one fatality and four malaria cases. In 2022, only 151 dengue cases were reported in Nagaland. Dimabrawa Tinda Patient Kun JE Idu Japanese Encephalitis Idu bimar lagi she, tahan do guhati de treatment loye she, aru idu tahan treatment lado last man wal loye she koi na janai di she. Aru idu patient kan la residential areas kan de health department kan wabi surveillance major steps kan la she koi na health and family welfare department kan wab janai di she. Workshop conducted on child trafficking in Peg. A sensitization workshop on preventing and combating child trafficking was held at. DPDP Hall Peck on July 24 with Tongpong L. Jamir, advocate at the Guwahati High Court Koima Bench as the resource person. Jamir gave a detailed presentation on child trafficking, explaining human trafficking networks, their causes, modus operandi, various case studies, relevant laws, and the roles of various stakeholders, such as the National Commission for Protection of Child Rights, State Commission for Protection of Child Rights, Police, NGOs, District Legal Service Authority, and others, according and others. July 24 day, DPDP Hall Peg Day, Ekta Sensitization Workshop Takishia Ari Itudu, Preventing and Combating Child Trafficking Law Opore, Itu Workshop Takishia Ari Itu Workshop Day, Guwahati High Court Koima Bench Wa, Advocate Tongpong L. Jamir Wa, Resource Person Takishia. Circular for nomination to Kohima and Chesaposo councils issued. Deputy Commissioner of Kohima, Kumar Ramnet Khan, IAS, has issued a circular for appointing four nominated members to the 
Koima Municipal Council and two nominated members to the Chesapozo Town Council. The circular has been issued to all concerned to submit names of the candidate to the Deputy Commissioner Koima on or before August 5 for onward submission to the government for necessary decision. Koima Municipal Council, the Jada nominated members, Arucha Zapozo, Town Council, Duda nominated members, Kange, Deputy Commissioner of Koima, Kumar Ramnet, IASWA, Circular Issue Kurishe. Aru Idu Circular Issue Kura Khan Concern Ge, Deputy Commissioner Koima, August 5, Noha Agere, Satmik Puri Koina, Janai Dishe. Ide Kani Manese, thank you for joining in. Aru Najagere, Ajila Weather Update, Silo. Nagaland Vitor Ajila weather updates of Nikange Janaiduo. Parent minimum 24 degrees Celsius to maximum 32 degrees Celsius. Dimapur minimum 28 degrees Celsius to maximum 36 degrees Celsius. Kohima minimum 20 degrees Celsius to maximum 29 degrees Celsius. Pack minimum 21 degrees Celsius to 31 degrees Celsius. Woka minimum 19 degrees Celsius to maximum 28 degrees Celsius. Zinapoto minimum 22 degrees Celsius to maximum 32 degrees Celsius. Kifri minimum 23 degrees Celsius to maximum 31 degrees Celsius. Mokshun minimum 24 degrees Celsius to maximum 32 degrees Celsius. Twinsang minimum 21 degrees Celsius to maximum 30 degrees Celsius. Mount minimum 26 degrees Celsius to maximum 34 degrees Celsius. Longland minimum 22 degrees Celsius to maximum 30 degrees Celsius. Idu Taisha Jilaga weather update. Nagaland TV, Sop Manulaga Awas. Watch us live on Geo TV and on your television sets as well. For Dumapu viewers, we are on channel number 994 in Global Chapter and Kohima and Mokokchong viewers, switch to channel number 138 on Hornbill Digital. For all news and updates, follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube and Twitter.